We connect creative entrepreneurs with a vacant space to bring the city alive. There's a risk to the individual property when it's vacant because it just degrades and it doesn't look attractive to a potential commercial tenant. A vacant property also reduces the number of people going to the area. Surrounding businesses um, can also be affected and then all of a sudden you have a whole group of vacancies. Creative industry is often quite experimental so it doesn't necessarily have um, the capital behind it. And if we don't provide low risk ways and low capital ways for people to test ideas and advance their uh, business, then people just won't be able to do it. There are untapped resources or areas of culture in Adelaide. A number of streets and areas aren't being utilised. When we have a property come to us, we will seek expressions of interest from the creative community. Then we pick the one that is the best fit for the space and the surrounding businesses. Working through the commercial concerns of a property owner in a way that also matches with the creative concerns is something that requires a particular focus and skill set. I think that core thing is the ability to bring the different industries together. We work with such a diverse range of people, so we work with property owners and we have people from the arts industry, young creatives, government people involved in the process. So. It's really a huge cross-section that we bring together. There's certainly economic benefits of a Renew project. Increasing the property values of the city because there are more field buildings and because it's a good place to be. I think it encourages risk-taking. It encourages people to develop ideas. It is beneficial for the city as a whole because we have people on the streets and going to new small businesses. It creates a culture of opportunity and innovation and gives people hope that they can actually do something and start something here.